want a chance to win a Pokemon booster box, all you gotta do is leave a like, comment, and be a subscriber to the channel. The winners will be announced once we hit 5,000 subscribers. Want more details on the giveaway? Check out the description of the video. Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to The Lion's Cave. Another new week, another episode of Man Cave Monday. Hopefully you guys had an amazing weekend and I'm here today again to kickstart your weekend. Your week. Oh my god. I'm still, still, still in the weekend mode. But um, it is Monday again and another chance for us to expand our man cave collection today we're opening another shining fates 10 the bolton v10 and we're also opening we're gonna start opening some of the packs from this battle styles booster box we're still trying to complete the master set and um i decided that we should crack into another booster box we opened one not too long ago um last week i believe um, we weren't able to put as pull as many cards that we needed for the master set. Uh, we weren't able to get any of the alternates, alternate arts in that box, but hopefully in this box, it'll be a different story. Um, so along with the battle styles, we'll be opening this Shining Fates 10. Um, so a total of 10 packs in today's video. Not for shabba -dabby. Pretty good amount of packs. Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, and we'll open four from this Battle Styles booster box. Um, honestly, Battle Styles has been one of my favorite sets um, ever, to be honest. Out of all the, out of all the sets that I've opened, modern, modern at least. Or yeah, I haven't opened a lot of vintage. But yeah, one of my favorite sets. I know um, it's it's not exactly super duper popular which is completely fine by me because that means there's just more for me to open so pretty happy about that um the prices are getting a little bit more affordable for battle styles so let's get on with today's opening we'll grab four hopefully it's one of each pack art beautiful these packs look really shiny for some reason i don't know if it was a reprint but i don't know if you guys can tell they look super super shiny but um let's um let's start off today's opening with the battle styles and we'll wrap it up with shining fates give me a sec just need to adjust the camera all right i think we're good let's get right into today's opening and if you guys are new to the channel please make sure to consider subscribing so you don't miss any Pokemon openings. And we open, we try to open every new Pokemon product over the weekend. We opened the Marnie Premium Tournament Collection Box as well as the two Calyrex boxes, Ice Rider Calyrex and Shadow Rider Calyrex. We had a lot of fun. Um, definitely worth checking those out, those videos out. We've got some pretty amazing pulls from um, the Calyrex boxes. So. Definitely recommend you checking that video out. All right, pack number one. Let's see if we can pull something nice out of here. All righty, we got a Sizzlepede Shinx, Cacnea, Ponyard. I forgot to mention, so um, some cards that I'm missing. I'm missing both. So far, I still need to pull both of the alternate Urshifu V Maxes. We got a Rapid Strike Mustard and a Tyranitar V. I'll take it. I will take it. Just to get my sleeves prepared next time. All right. I will definitely take it. Um, it's not a card that I need, but I'm pretty sure I pulled all the regular Vs from the set by now. So yeah. Um, you're guaranteed about four to five regular V's from a booster box. So, and these packs feel kind of weird. They're really bright. I hope they're not fake. I'm gonna have to. Ooh, what is that? Is that line? Has that line always been there? I don't know. I'm gonna have to compare them to some other packs that I have. But yeah, they they look really really bright and. I mean, the the card store that I bought from generally pretty reputable, so I guess shouldn't have anything to worry about. But I, I kind of feel like we should try to 
we might have to try to rip one of the cards here. Reverse Sizzle Pete and a regular rare Stone Journey. Yeah, they're like super shiny. I don't remember it. Hold on a sec. Let me see if I can find a pack. All right, so I have a triple blister here. And as you can see, we have a... Do we have an Empoleon pack? I'm trying to grab an Empoleon pack. There you go. From the booster box. Yeah. Can you guys tell the difference? This one's like a lot sharper. The coloring. Um, that is definitely a little bit sketchy. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. It does feel a bit weird, but we'll see. We'll see, I suppose. Yeah, they're really bright. And this little flab here feels like it got cut off a little bit too soon. It feels like it's usually a little bit longer. Yeah, if you, if you look at the Shining Fates one, right? It covers, you can cover my whole thumb. But this one, not quite. You can see a part of it. That is so sketchy. And it has this little M symbol there. I don't know, guys. Looks a bit interesting to me. Anyways, next code card is RV. Uh, R for Rowlet, V for Vulpix. Um, so yeah, make sure to write those down. We'll reveal the code card very, very soon. Uh, we got a Reverse Hollow Durant and a Karina's Focus Rainbow Rare. All right. I mean, the card doesn't look fake. <laughs> Wow, what a hit. All right, definitely one of the better cards to pull. I don't know if it takes the place of the alternate art card, but definitely one of the cards that I need for the master set, so pretty happy about that. But I'm still, I still quite can't get over how shiny the packs are, the packaging. Maybe, maybe I'm just overthinking it, but it does feel weird. I've opened so many battle styles by now. This one looks, definitely feels and looks a little bit different. All right, I'm gonna reveal the code card. Here you go. Honestly, at this point, I should probably just keep the rest of the pack sealed because we basically pulled the best card, most likely, best card from the booster box. Um, but yeah, we'll see. We have a Corfish, Salandit, Roller Cola, Esper. Shinx, we got a Dotler, Dublade, Pig Knight, a Reverse Hollow Shinx, and a Single Strike Urshifu V Max. Wow. Three out of four hits from Battle Styles. Really? Got really lucky there. I'm seriously considering if I should leave the rest of the box sealed. Because we got like most of the hits already. We might be missing like one full art, but that's pretty much it. All right, single strike Urshifu V Max, very awesome looking card. But let's get right into shining fights. Still a lot of shinies we're looking for um, in shining fates. Um, let's see, I'm trying to think of one that on top of my head. Suicune. That's what we're looking for. Decidueye. Um, Rillaboom, Inteleon, Cinderace, those we're still looking for. Alright, next code card, secret letters are K and R. K for Kangaskhan, R for Rillaboom. We got a reverse Indeedy, regular rare Yan Mega. Alright, on to the next one. Honestly, if we only pull like a couple shinies, as long as they're shiny cards that we don't... Ah, I forgot to reveal the code. Don't worry, I'll reveal it shortly. Um, as long as, even if we only get a couple shinies, as long as they're shinies that we don't have for the master set, I will be a happy camper. We have, okay, reverse hollow naked. Oh, a Greedent V. Um, I feel like I have this card already, but I'm not sure. Not a card that I see very often. Okay, completely forgot this guy was in the set. Greedent V. Uh, we'll put that on this side. Since it's uh, for Shining Fates. Alright, reveal the code. Here you go. 
Thank you so much for watching. Next pack, here we go. And for those of you who are wondering, um, I did get this Shining Fates tin from EB Games. So yeah, definitely, Shining Fates definitely became a lot easier to find. And it is a lot easier to find. For those of you who are who are still looking for Shining Fates by any chance, um, the Pokemon Center website has them as well. So yeah, definitely very available now. Reverse Hollow Dreadnought and a regular rare Celebi. All right, onto the Charizard pack. Here we go. Next code card is LL, Cool J? <laughs> L for um, Lillipup. There you go. I don't know why I can't, and Lapras. There you go. I'm trying to think of an OG Kanto one. Reverse more Peko and a regular rare Boss's Orders. Last two, oh, forgot to give away the code. Here you go. Happy, happy claiming. All right, still no shinies. Hopefully we can pull at least one. Um, that's what sh that's what Shining Fates is all about, anyways. Next code card is two C, um, number two and C for Cramorant. Cramorant, man, so fun on Pokemon Unite. Let me know in the comments section below. Cramorant, there you go. If you guys have been playing Ooh. Pokemon Unite as well, Minchino, baby shiny, so cute. I don't think I have this one yet. Pretty happy about that. And another boss's orders. I'll take it. Boss's orders. Very playable card for sure. I will definitely take it. Alright. Minchino Shiny. Not bad, not bad. Little mouse. <laughs> or is he a squirrel? I don't think he's a squirrel. It's kind of like a what is Minchino? What is that? What animal is Minchino based on? I would love to know. Ah, I forgot to give away the code. Don't worry, I will give it away very, very soon after this pack is opened. We got a Horsey Rowlet, more Peko Spinarak. Speaking of Rowlet, that baby shiny Rowlet and Shining Fates is so cute. Oh, baby shiny Shloom. Not bad, I think. There was like a, a playmat, dice, and deck box, and sleeves series for Snoom, or including Snoom and Pokemon Center. It's pretty cute. And a Hollow Thievil. Oh, nice. We're actually getting some shinies that we need for the set. Pretty happy about that, to be honest with you guys. Pretty happy. Um, even though, I'm pretty sure these aren't like super expensive or anything, but they're new. Definitely new cards that I need for the set. Very happy about that indeed. And as for the code card, here you go, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's video as much as I did, please make sure to drop that like button. It really, is a, really does help the channel. really appreciate the support. And uh, make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel and or if you guys have not done so already. But that is it for me today, guys. Hopefully, you guys are doing well. Um, there will be some videos that will show up here on the side very shortly for you guys to check out. But that is it for me today, guys. Hopefully, you guys are doing well. Staying safe until next time. Take it easy.